Welcome back to Service 7. Today we're tackling teamwork, a crucial component of a better work experience and ultimately better patient care. Here are seven strategies to build a harmonious culture that supports collaboration, high quality care, and healthier, happier patients. First, prioritize the patient. We should all be after the same goal, what's best for the patient. That means putting egos aside to arrive at the best collaborative action plan possible to treat each person who walks through the door. Working together toward a shared goal is the best way to get results. Next up, pitch in. We've all probably said or heard someone say, I can't do that, it isn't my job, or I've never done that before. Instead, try taking the initiative by picking up a ringing phone or bringing a patient to an exam room when someone else is busy. Even small gestures build stronger bonds between your coworkers. And because teamwork is contagious, you'll soon find your coworkers doing the same. Three, speak up and listen too. Being able to comfortably ask for help and accept advice is critical to success. Everyone's perspective is valuable. You play a big role in shaping your office environment for the better or worse. Take advantage of the insights of others to improve your performance and the environment you work in. Number four, don't take team lightly. More than 70% of medical errors stem from dysfunctional team dynamics. Being sarcastic or rude, never apologizing, or simply failing to say hello at all can take an emotional toll that impacts collective performance. Unfortunately, patients suffer the consequences. Five, empowering employees. Leadership should strive to set a course with clearly defined goals, but it shouldn't be a one-way street. You are on the front lines of patient care and your opinions matter. Regular team brainstorming sessions can improve accountability and a collective sense of responsibility for patient care. This can prevent errors and save lives. Next at number six, recognize. Look for opportunities to publicly recognize peers when they do something well and consider instituting regular rewards programs for both team and individual performance. When you and your coworkers feel valued, you'll strive to do your best. And finally, seventh, allow time for downtime. It isn't realistic or productive to focus on work for every second of the day. At the appropriate time, it's okay to chat with coworkers about life outside the office because happiness and harmony isn't always about the bottom line. Thanks for watching Service 7. Follow these tips and you'll see firsthand that teamwork will not only improve the health of your patients, but your happiness and performance as well.